hello friends this is Vidhan welcome you to my channel today we will see a concept from quantum mechanics we will see the general state of a particle with the spin half or the spin state of a particle with the spin half or the spin function the general spin function of a particle with a spin half so normally the spin function or the spin state of a particle is represented by the symbol chi and is given as a column matrix of A and B. Now if you want to find S X, what is this? This is the X component of the spin. This is called X component of the spin angular momentum quantum number. We know there are two types of angular momentum quantum numbers one is the orbital angular momentum quantum number another is the spin angular momentum quantum number orbital angular momentum quantum number represented by l's lx ly lz etc and the spin angular momentum quantum number represented by sx sy sz so this is the x component of the spin angular momentum quantum number or normally we can say x component of the spin so if we measure the x component of the spin on this function what are the results that we will get we will get only two results at a time we will get only one result but there are two possibilities so at ma at maximum we can get two results either we will get plus s cut by 2 or we will get minus h cut by 2 so these are the two possibilities for results if you measure sx on this spin state now what is the probability that you will get plus h cut by 2 and that probability is given by half mod a plus b squared now what is the probability that if you measure sx on this function you will get minus h cut by 2 and that probability is given by half mod a minus b squared similarly you can also find s y that means the y component of the spin angular momentum quantum number on this function and again what are the results that are possible two results are possible either you will get plus h cut by 2 or you will get minus h cut by 2 now what is the probability that you find s y on this function and you get plus h cut by 2 not minus h cut by 2 so what is the probability that probability is given by half mod a minus i b squared and what is the probability that you find s y on this spin state and you get minus h cut by 2 but not plus h cut by 2 and that probability is given by half mod a plus i b squared now you can see that we also have the provision to find as z you can also find the z component of the spin on this function so if you measure z component then what are the results possible again only two results are possible one result that is possible is plus h square by 2 and the other result that is possible is minus h square by 2 now what is the probability that you find s z and you will get plus h square by 2 that, prob that probability is just mod a squared and what is the probability that you will get minus h square by 2 when you are measuring s z not s y s x and that probability is just mod of b squared so one thing is to be noticed that irrespective of you measure sx sy or sz the results that are possible are only either plus h cut by 2 or minus h cut by 2 same here if you measure sy the possible result is either plus h cut by 2 or minus h cut by 2 here also plus s square 2 or minus s square 2 but for sx 
the probability of finding plus x square 2 is this and for probability of finding minus x square 2 is this and these two things are different from these two things and these two things are different from these two things that means it depends what you are measuring if you are measuring sx these two things are okay but the their, their probability of finding is different so this is something that you should remember there are questions that will follow on this topic thank you